Hello, I'm Artifacts of Mars, and this is Disclosure. Coming to you from the beautiful uh, late summer uh, plains of sunny western New York State. And today we're going to look at one of the Spirit Soul 56 photos. Not a huge amount seeing this one, but entertaining at least. And there is one decent artifact. First thing I'm going to show you though is a fossil encrusted rock. Uh, all you have to do is look around in these photos and you'll see fossils in them. It's just blatantly, blatantly obvious. This is one that I chose. I made a little model for it. It's nothing spectacular. But, uh, it's just to show that... It's this thing right here. It's just to show you that there are fossils and... They're blatant, they're right out in the open, and they're ignored by the press, they're ignored by NASA, they're ignored. There's another example. That just goes to show you, and after we get done here, I'm going to take you to the Second Life and show you the models. They're all over the place. Uh, life in these photos is all over the place. It's just kind of luck. But if you put on your blinders and say, Nah, it can't be life because NASA says so. Screw that. It's just blatantly obvious. Alright? Take a look at the, uh, this big boulder. I don't even bother with the, uh, drawings, but you can see that it's got all these impressions in it. They've known that there's life there. They've known it for the longest time. They've known it ever since the first set of probe down. Probably known it since uh, Viking. But they ignore the evidence. That's how these people operate. They ignore the evidence Pretend it isn't there, and then you and I get screwed out of our tax dollars. Well, here's an artifact I missed. Uh, jeepers. Looks like a round metal disc inside this uh, hood. I missed it. I didn't, don't have a model for it. That'd be a tough one to do anyway. So there's a few things. Let's take a look at the main object. This object, I don't know what it is. I don't believe for an instant that that's natural, by the way. Just don't see rocks forming like that. My model really doesn't do it justice in a way, but... It's still interesting to me as a researcher. Uh, looks like it was laid there not too long ago, I would say. I have no idea what that could be. A few interesting things are in front of it, too. There's some artifacts in this uh, photo. I just stuck to the main one on this one because it's so blatant that you can't miss it. Notice it has a flat end on it, and then it's cylindrical. Zero chance that's natural. 
All right. Well, I'm going to take you to Second Life and show you the build on Second Life. Same photo. This is Selector Panel. That's the one. One Curious Dark Artifact and a Bonus Fossil Encrusted Rock. I try, I've been trying to place them uh, the approximate place where they are in the photo uh, for reference. That's just a sculpty. I used a texture from uh, some educational website. Uh, a fossil texture. That's just to illustrate the fossils that we're seeing. I mean, they're blatantly obvious. If you want to ask, yeah, that's a real second life ray gun. It works. I'm taking over the model that I made. My model, like I said, don't do it justice. But, uh... Well, at least it illustrates that there is something there. It's uh, an obvious artifact. I'm kind of limited in what I can do. But it's an obvious artifact. It's just blatantly, blatantly obvious that we're seeing something artificial. I'm not an artist, I don't know how to use a lot of the fancier programs, to be honest. I think it conveys the message, though. There is an artifact there. It's blatant. It's obvious. My model isn't too different. And here's the point. Like I said many times before, you're being lied to. I can't believe these people, they have no shame whatsoever. I've been through some rough times, but Artifacts of Mars is back. And doing research. I will not back down. We're seeing life. We're seeing artifacts. And I want to show one more object. I decided it may not be in the photo that uh, I put up. The number of photos that had the same thing in. Kind of a cylindrical, dark cylindrical thing. And there's a little knobber jobber right I'll do the drawing again. There's a little knob that sticks out from it right there. I'm still trying to figure that one out. I don't know if it's just an odd rock it could be or something else. Why well, I didn't include it, I'm not certain it's an artifact. Well, that'll uh, do it for today. Uh, there's a number of different objects in this photo that are quite interesting to me. And the one. Like I said, it's just a blatant, blatant artifact. There couldn't be any more blatant uh, if somebody 
stood up and screamed at the top of my lungs that there's an artifact there. Of course there is. It doesn't match any of the rocks around it. Looks like uh, maybe cast iron or something. Well, that's about it. Uh, this is Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching. And I'll get started on the next uh, one. I don't know what it'll be. Thanks for watching.